from a neuroscience perspective, why is empathy or what is the role of empathy in rebuilding trust and why might it be so important? So the empathy is important in trust for a number of reasons, but one of the things is that empathy helps to create a feeling of safety. And probably I would say most of the things that we're looking for here come under that umbrella of needing to feel safe. And we feel safe by feeling protected. We feel safe by being part of the, the group. That Now that are you still part of my in-group? Are you still going to take care of me? And consistent behavior. Oh, can we get back to some level of consistency? Our brains love consistency. And can we get back to some level where I can predict the way that we're going to enjoy engage in our relationship? So I think that I'd like to put that under that whole safety umbrella for the time being. And empathy increases each of those. Yeah. Um, and I, if you, I'm going to remind our audience that when we talk about feeling protected, then part of it is feeling that we were treated or that everyone was, around us was treated fairly. Um, because that, if I'm not being treated fairly, that actually, is, you, you, I just remind everybody, that invokes the same circuitry as disgust. And if I'm disgusted with you, then it's difficult to get back to a level of trust. Empathy, being empathetic, showing empathy, showing vulnerability, um, mm -hmm. It's, if it was your fault to start with, but even if it's even if it was the other person that did it, you allowing that person to come back into your life, and empathy will tend to be a driver towards that. 